The Cookbook Collector is a very modern, very contemporary novel by Allegra Goodman, who has a, a good reputation as a novelist already before this book was published. It's um, set in the dot-com era. It's basically about two sisters, Emily and Jess, in their 20s, both very clever young women, but incredibly different. They get on very, very well, have a close bond, and meet regularly and, and, and talk a lot about all sorts of issues. Emily is a, a techie, geek, really, and she's living in the dot-com world with a lot of predominantly geeky young men who are all incredibly clever and creative and inventing brilliant things to do with the internet and so on. I don't understand much about that world, but I found it totally fascinating. Emily has set up her own company, Veritech, and it is going to become um, highly significant in the, in the whole um, technical, technical internet world. And she floats it on the market and, of course, um, earns lots of money, certainly on paper. On paper, she ends up being worth hundreds of millions of dollars. Her sister Jess, in complete contrast, is um, studying philosophy, uh, is, a, is a vegetarian, I think she's vegan actually, and uh, works part-time in a rather dusty but absolutely fascinating antiquarian bookshop. And in that antiquarian bookshop, um, the bookshop discovers this collection of antique cookbooks. The owner is a man who adores the books. He's probably in his early 40s. When he finds absolute treasures, he can't bear to put them in the shop. He likes to keep them at home, so he has a marvellous collection himself. And Jess and the owner of the antique bookshop go and discover this amazing collection of antique cookbooks that have been kept by this old guy, some of them in his oven, all over his kitchen, all over his house, this amazing collection, and they are genuine originals in many cases, an original Mrs. Beaton and so on. And the, this book delves on, in some instances, into some of the contents of the cookbooks. You learn, for example, about sugar being first used in recipes and fascinating things. The contrast between the two sisters is really striking. And there's also a romance in here, which is beautifully handled. Now, I'm, I don't, I'm not particularly into romances, but this is genuinely, I, I describe it as a romance because it happens very slowly in the book, and you find yourself totally charmed and delighted with it. And again, it forms a, a lovely contrast to the often quite hard-nosed, competitive nature of the technological world that is also going on in this book. So, a book of contrasts, beautifully written, absolutely fascinating, and a total joy to read, The Cookbook Collector by Allegra Goodman.